Hi guys. Uh, I want to go ahead and show you the uh, tuner. Uh, here's the uh, the cable that comes with it. So this is a power cable for the backlight on the S meter. And the tuner has a inductance switch. Capacitance on the transmitter side and capacitance on the antenna side. Pretty straightforward little tuner. Okay, let me show you the uh, back of the unit. Okay, this is the back of the uh, antenna tuner. And you have your transmitter in. You have an AB switch for your power level. Your lamp meter or the meter for the lamp. And again, that just plugs in right there, 12 volts. Uh, you can connect the ground in here. Ground is a, f a good safety feature. Connect that right in there. Now you get a lot of options with antennas. That this is a little portable unit, but you have a lot of options with it. You can use a balanced line, like a ladder line, and it would connect into these little terminals here. Now, if you're going to use a balanced ladder line, you also need to put a little jumper wire from here to here. Uh, and it, it says that right here on the back. Uh, if you just want to use this terminal, this terminal is for a random wire antenna. If you're not familiar with random wire antennas, that's exactly what it means. It's just a random length of wire. And the uh, tuner will help bring that single piece of wire into resonance. And then you have uh, an antenna for your, your coax. Okay. On the side, the sides are, uh, they have these four little mounting screws, screw holes. These are for uh, if you're going to connect it up to a one of S, uh, MFJ's uh, portable radio transceivers. And the same on the other side. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and crack this guy open here and let you uh, take a look at the inside. I'm going to widen this out here just a little bit this is the only YouTube video that you will get to see the inside of this little antenna tuner And you can see there's just four little screws that hold that on there. And here you go. Alright, so if you're looking inside this little guy. Turn this a little around this way maybe. Uh, you can see you have your capacitance adjustments, your inductor, basically you're just picking off a, you can see where the switch, see if I can zoom this in here so you can see it, when you rotate the switch you're just picking a different point in the inductor. So you can see this little point here goes there, this point here comes all the way up here, there's a point down there goes all the way to the bottom. So as you're rotating this switch, you're literally just picking the length of that inductor. Okay. Looks like back here in the back we have a, uh, a ferrite bead, wrapped ferrite bead on our balance line. And a little circuit board here uh, with your uh, switches to uh, pick up uh, not only illumination for the S meter but also your power range. Ok. 
Okay. All right. So that's about it. Run this guy back out here. I'm going to go ahead and throw this uh, cover back on. Show you the uh, what we're going to be connecting this to, and we're going to. I'll be showing you this uh, this completed uh, transceiver in a separate video. I want to show you the each individual pieces one at a time. Okay, so that is the model MFJ971 portable antenna tuner. And we're going to be connecting that in with our MFJ20 meter single sideband. This is an MFJ9420. And what the you'll see these little bracket holes line up here. There's a little bracket. I'll show you how to inst how that installation goes together in a, in a later video. But this is where we're this is where we're kind of going here. Okay. All right. There you have it. I appreciate you watching. AF5DN. Thanks a lot.